Today we're going to be do demonstrating the calcaneus views. The routine views for calcaneus will be an axial view, which is the plantar dorsal projection, and we're going to be doing a lateral. Uh, the film size for both will be a 10 by 12, and it will be lengthwise. The technique for the axial projection is going to be 60 kV at 10 mass. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to have the patient lying on the table, and they're going to have their sock and their shoe off and we're going to have you extend your leg out for me. I'm going to lay the shield on the patient. And if your patient was unable to take and bring their foot back here, which I'm going to show you in just a second, we might have them use a towel or a sheet or gauze or something that they could wrap around their foot. They'll actually pull their foot back. Because what we need to do with the foot is we're going to have to dorsiflex the foot to, to a point that the plantar surface here is going to be perpendicular here to the, to the IR. Okay, and I'm sort of, as I'm centering this, I'm sort of positioning because I am going to be angling so I know that the film is going to be a little bit higher because I'm throwing the calcaneus up on the film. So we're going to have the patient again to uh, dorsiflex the foot and then our centering is going to be to the third metatarsal and to the center of the, the bottom of the foot there. Now what I want to try to do then, I'm going to open up my collimation so I can see I'm at to the center of the foot, so I'm pretty close. And I also want to look this way and make sure I'm to the center of the, the film here, and I am. Okay. And then our collimations can come back in to the skin margin side to side. And then I'm going to get all the calcaneus on there. I'm going to put my marker, leave room here on the side for my marker. Right here. Okay, and uh, this is going to be our axial projection or our plantar dorsal projection for the calcaneus. So the tube angle on this is going to be uh, 40 degrees. Our tube angle is going to be 40 degrees. And again, we're going to, we're going to center to the, 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 the third metatarsal. And then you should just see it projected down the about the center of the calcaneus as it goes onto the film. Okay? And this is our axial projection for the calcaneus. Our next view is going to be our lab. So we're going to take our tube angle off. And I should have mentioned it is going to be a 40 inch SID for both axial and for the lateral projection. Okay, so we're going to have the patient to, if you would, roll onto your right side, roll up toward me. Okay, and we are going to have the patient to dorsiflex the foot. And just like we do for a lateral foot, we're going to get the plantar surface. We're going to bring the knee up until we get the plantar surface, the, the heel and the, the base of the foot or the bottom of the foot here should be perpendicular to the IR. Our centering for this is going to be about one inch down or inferior to the medial malleolus. Okay. Okay. I'm going to make sure I'm centered to my film here. We'll open up the collimation both ways. Make sure I get the film centered and centered this way. Then we'll collimate back down. Now, as far as our collimation on this, we need to have our collimation needs to include the entire calcaneus. We're going to see up about an inch of the uh, distal tip fib. And then we also need to get to the base of the fifth metatarsal, a common fracture site there in the foot. So we want to make sure all that is included. Again, we have plenty of room here for our marker placement. The, uh, the foot is perpendicular to the IR, is how we need it to be. The technique's going to remain uh, a little, I'm sorry, the technique is actually going to change. It's going to be a little different. It's going to be about 55 kV at 8 mass. Because of, uh, on the angling pro uh, projection, we have to have a little bit more because you're going through more of the, of the calcaneus. In this position here, we go down a little bit because there's not as much uh, meat on the heel there, so we want to make sure it's not going to black it out by having too much technique. And these will be our uh, calcaneus views for the hill.